What's up, everybody? Feels bad here. So we are back. So I believe I forgot to show all of you the power play lines in the last video. But just to reiterate, these are the lines going into the season. Some of you might think put um, Juju. I cannot pronounce his name. Juju R. Kararia, uh up a line. And my rebuttal to that is... Actually, I'm going to do it. I'm going to do it, actually. Uh, let's see. Who has a better face-off? I skipped past it. 79. Zach Cassian. 60. Okay, so Broad is going to rock the middle. That's it. We'll put Ty Reddy on the right wing, since he is a right wing. Okay, good, good, good. Excuse me. Great. So we are moving on now. Here's the defensive lines, just to reiterate. Kind of just show you quickly. We don't, I don't really need to show you that much. And we are going to be rocking with Talbot and Miko Koskinen, who actually in real life just got a massive extension, which kind of seems foolish. But what can you say? It's Pete Shirelli. You know, he's not going to do anything different. Anyway, power play lines. We are going to double shift Taylor Hall. Um... And we're going to rock Drysaddle, McDavid, Hall, and then the Nuge, Eberle, and Hall on the second line power play. So, did I show? I don't think I showed PK either. PK, we're going to be rocking with this. I know it looks a little weird, but <laughs> sorry for the banner. We're rocking this a little bit. Um, yeah, I mean, let, let's just see how it goes. We'll see how it goes. We are going to be hopefully simming up all the way to the trade deadline in this video. So first, we got to quickly sim through preseason. My expectations for this year are they're high. I, I think that we can make the playoffs, especially because the Pacific Division is kind of weak. So I definitely think we'll be able to conquer that division. So let me sim through the preseason, see how we do. Man, the banners are really annoying. I'm actually just going to go and turn this off real quick because it's annoying me. And it's probably annoying you. Anyway, back into the sim. Oh, God, we're probably going to have a bad year since we're doing well in the preseason. Let's just finish off the preseason, get to the regular season. Um, I know some of you don't like the fact that the, the lines and then the trades I made are not realistic. Um, this is more of just kind of wanting to see what would happen in an alternate universe if Peter Shirelli never made that dumb trade with the Devils um, for Adam Larson and Taylor Hall one for one. So we are going to go sim up to the... Actually, you know, we're going to go month by month here. So let's do the month of October, the starting month. Let's see how this goes. Um, obviously, we can make line changes if need be, and that was a... Wow, that was... Wow! <laughs> wow, what a terrible first two games. But we bounce back with a win. Let's see if we can stay on the winning streak. Wow. Oh, my lordy lord. We are letting in a lot of goals. Taylor Hall might not be. I, I mean, I want to run with him. I really do. I really want to run with with um, Cam Talbot. Did I say Taylor Hall before? I meant to say Cam Talbot. He seems to be bouncing back now. We did have a better second half to that month. We are currently on a five-game winning streak, and we have won uh, six of the last seven, and we did get a point. So we are on a seven-game point streak, which is nice after just, in a wow, just blown up. I mean, look at this. 5-2 loss, 5-2 loss, 6-2 loss. Like, if we're going to be a playoff team, that is not acceptable. Um, we'll keep going, though. Because we did start to bounce back. We'll see, we'll see how it goes. Hopefully, Cam Talbot just doesn't freaking wet the bed again. I mean, four goals. Okay, you can you can see that in a game. Four goals. That's that's fine. But like when we're losing like 6-2, that, those are major red flags. Another 6-2 loss. Jesus. I don't know if it's Cam Talbot or Miko Koskinen, but one of them is just letting all of these freaking goals. And it's actually just insane. I'm okay with like shootout and OT losses because points are points, right? Uh, definitely could use the points. We are on a four games, five games against the Pacific Division teams. We did okay. 
we did okay. We we got points in a lot of them, which which is okay. Um, let's take a look and see who's putting up points. I'm assuming it's Taylor Hall and McDavid. Jesus, Taylor Hall has a lot of assists. Oh man, I think that first line is really producing, which would be fan freaking Dabby Dozy. Now McDavid's only twelve and twelve. That might just be because he's with. Um, Taylor Hall and Taylor Hall is getting double shifted on the power play. That's something I want to check out next. Second line minus eight, minus two, minus five, minus three. Oh, wow. Okay. Uh, what line is that? I mean, that's the third line. That's the third line. That's the s second line. And then this is the first line. Who's his partner? Let's go to defenseman. I just want to see, is it that first line pairing? I have Larson's there, but he's a minus five. So I don't really know what to expect because we don't really have anyone else to put up there. The Oilers do really lack defensemen. So let's, I mean, I don't really want to change anything, to be completely honest. I mean, I kind of just want to ride it out. In our last 10, we were 3, 4, and 3, but I really just want to ride it out and see how it goes. Let's check out our power play. So if we go to power play percentage, we are, okay, That that's a good power play percentage. That's what I like to see. Now, penalty kill. Yeah, wow. Okay, that is, we're really, we're getting a lot of power play goals, but a lot of people are scoring power play goals on us. So let's change the penalty kill lines because that just, that's, whew, wow, that's bad. Okay. Um, not something, something that can be fixed. I mean, how are your defensive stats? You're not a bad defensive player. I don't think it's you two. Who was, let me, let's see this, uh, plus minus. Plus one, plus zero. I mean, it's, it's, it's bad, but it's not horrible. Minus two and minus three. Okay, so I think we just need to change it. Okay, hold on. Plus three, minus eight, plus nine, plus ten. Okay, so Chris Russell's a plus ten. Jeez. <laughs> okay. Um, I don't know. Maybe Clef Bomb's not right for this. Maybe we go with Larson. We'll, we'll go with Larson and see how... He is a defensive defenseman, so we're going to put Larson in there. Darnell Nurse... He's a two-way. He's doing okay. He's actually doing okay. Um, new dry sidle here. See, Brodziak's a guy for that, right? Unless we split them up. So let's put Zach Cassian up here, and then let's move. I mean, who has the better defensive stats? I mean, you're the bigger hitter. <sighs> we're gonna go with Tobias Ryder and then we're gonna put uh Brodziak here. See how that goes. Actually we could put Brian Strom. Where is we could put Brian Strom. Let's see what his defensive stats are. Oh he's a playmaker. No 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 no. Let's no. Okay. Never mind. Thought he was a two-way. Uh, he's a playmaker, apparently. Um, so let's change that. Now, are you guys doing okay? Plus zero, plus zero. Okay. The third line is... Okay, maybe we need to mix up the third line here. So, let's move... They can't keep pucks out of the net. So let's put Cassian up here with Reader and Strom, and then we'll move... Jujuar Kiaria down there. I'll never pronounce his name right. I'm not expecting to pronounce his name right. It is what it is, boys. All right, so those are the line changes. Um, we'll take it probably three games at a time. All right, we'll sim a week. Let's sim a week. We'll go to the 8th of December, and let's see how that goes. Wow, great start. Okay, okay. Loving that. Can we bounce? No. Okay, so those line changes didn't work. What's not working? It might just be goaltending. Oh, 
If it's Golting, I can't really do anything about it. I, I really can't do anything about it. I mean, they're not playing horrible. The first line's not getting scored on. Okay, now the second line's... Wow, now the second line being lit up. And they're getting worse. So... Um... We'll do this, maybe? I mean, I'm trying anything. Um, are you a left winger? Okay, yeah. Let's actually put you on your right wing. Your correct wings. Um, trying to think here. Trying to think. There's no one in the AHL I can bring up, right? Yeah, no. No, no, no. No one's developed enough. Okay. Oh, God. This line is just not... It's just not. It's just not. Do we take the nudes off of this line? I think we take the nudes down and put them here. That might hurt us too. But I gotta try something different. We're not. We're gonna actually give him some actual wingers, and we're gonna see how that goes. Uh, I guess Ryan Storm will play up here. I don't know. I'm trying some weird things because we need it and. Okay, is there anyone I can place? I mean, I could put Darnell Nurse up there, but I don't really want to mess with his growth. Let's check out team stats. Let's let's see if our power play or penalty kill got worse from where it was. Because it, it might be the penalty kill, and I might have made a huge, huge Debbie Dozy mistake. Okay. Our penalty kill did get worse. Our power play did get a little bit worse worse but it's still at the top yeah we are yeah okay but our penalty kill that got worse so uh we might have to try out some new faces on that end i really don't know what i could do i mean my hands are kind of tied with i did this to myself but it's just kind of like just you know i'm trying to make a playoff team that might be not a playoff team i mean it would make sense for them to be a playoff team in a way. You would hope that you would just blow away the competition by scoring a bunch, but it might not be the case for this team. So I don't think Adam Larson's working here. Well, uh, we'll put Nudavara. I mean, we're, we're just going to try anything here. Um, you're not doing well. Are you doing okay? Reader is not. We'll put Brodziak and Cassian up there. And we'll put Drysaddle there, and we'll put down someone. Who are we going to put down here? We'll give you another chance, Juju. Um, see how that goes. I'm sure goalies are now terrible, right? No, they, I think I checked that. I did check that. Okay. Um, I mean, I guess we just hope for the best. I mean... I don't really know what to say or do. I'm just trying to find the right power play. I mean, penalty kill lines, I guess. So, moving forward, can we get a dub? No. Okay, we finally got a win after a while. Okay, we're doing one for one now. Maybe we'll 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 give it some more games. Maybe we'll start to, you know, people get comfortable with their line mates, and we'll start to go one way or the other. And we're going the other way. Um, we'll go to Vancouver. If we lose this game against Tampa Bay, see, I don't know. I don't know. We'll go one more. We'll go one more. We'll, we will go one more. It's probably going to have to be a lot of, okay, we won. So it's, we'll see. Maybe they'll get comfortable. No. We'll go to the end of the month. Hey, okay, we might have to move Everly down. Wait, we won. So it's just, I don't know. This team is just so, like, one and one. Like, come on. I don't know if it's enough to warrant, a, if we lose. Yeah, okay, we are now, okay. Okay. Oh, boy. I thought we would be a playoff team year one. We might be looking more like a lottery team, uh, which isn't the worst thing. I mean, we do... I mean, look at the lines, right? It's just... We're going to move Drysaddle up. 
I'm gonna move Nuge back up, and then Everly here, and then boom. Now, let's see. Yeah, that's bad. And are you guys ever? No, you guys aren't. So we're actually gonna do this. We're gonna try to keep our third line and just be like, hey, you can't score on our third line. That would be nice. Uh, defensively, I mean, there's nothing I can do. Oh, now everyone's just, oh, God. Oh, wait, you're a minus five now. That means our... Let's see our goalies, too. I mean, again, I can't really do anything about them. Uh, they're bad. They're doing bad, but they're not, like... I mean, they're bad. I'm trying to sugarcoat it, but at least it's not 0. 0.8. <laughs> it's not in there. Um, team stats. Just to see power play and penalty kill. We are all the way down here now. Our penalty kill stayed the same. And our power play got a little bit worse. So, I mean, our power play is still very potent, but it's a 5-on-5, five five, I really do think. I mean, our penalty kill is pretty bad, but, like, we're losing a lot of games, I feel like, when we're not even taking penalties. We're just allotting a lot of goals, which is, I mean, with the defense we have, it's just... Okay. We might have... Let's just go to the trade deadline. Um, we'll go, if I see something major, we'll stop it. But if we keep losing games, I might just, you know, might just suck it up and realize, like, hey, we're just that kind of team. Um, we might be a draft lottery team this year, and maybe we'll draft a defenseman, or, I don't know. Definitely probably pick the best available person. Don't draft for need. Um, we're kind of bouncing back a little bit. But not enough to warrant, like, hey, we're going to be a playoff team. Uh, I'm trying, though. I'm really trying. <laughs> oh, boy. Yeah, we're like one for one, and it's really annoying. Because you can't, you can't build anything off of it. All right, all right. Yeah, I think we're throwing in the towel this year, boys. It's a shame. I didn't think we had to, but I, I just don't... Th I think it's just... Fate at this point. We there's nothing we can do. Oy vey. It's just we're not scoring enough to warrant the defense we have. We're not like Pittsburgh where it's like they keep scoring and that's how they win games. Um the VR I don't wanna say it. I don't wanna say it. Well, I, I kinda have to. We are doing better. Um I don't think we're going to come back and make the playoffs. It would be an insane run if we did. We might have to start looking at chipping players for an extra pick. But it's too late to do that now. I mean, Taylor Hall is going off, which is what you'd imagine. But the rest of the team is just not not, not doing it. I mean, David, too. Yeah, of course. Dry settle. Okay. That's second line. Like, you know, it's just, oy vey. Uh, I mean, I don't know. I, I don't know what to do. I don't think there's anything I can do. I think it's just, I think it's just fate at this point. Maybe it's either we turn it around or it's just, I don't know. Uh... All right, I guess I guess I call it here. I mean, there's nothing exciting. I mean, I can look. Actually, you know what? For the next video, I'm gonna map out and see if we can get rid of anyone that we don't need and try to get some more picks. Cause I, I got rid of our picks, a lot of them, and it backfired. Cause now we don't have picks, and I'll chalk that up to me trying to do something. So, um, if you like the video, like it. <laughs> Uh, subscribe if you wish, and I'll see you boys in the next one.